What's up guys? My name's Trevor. Welcome back to the Art to Vet YouTube channel. Check out that. Oof. Man, them tires look good. But that's not what today is all about. Today is all about the Dodge and uh, realizing how silly I am. And uh, well, guys, if you're gonna tow a truck, just like uh, Justin over here says, check the hood, pop the hood, check the battery, grab that key. And then, once you're inside, watch this magic. Watch, watch, are you guys ready for this? Doo. Oh, oh, yeah, look. I didn't have to die of heat. I didn't have to die of heat. Yep, I did that to myself. That, that was my, that was all my fault. But, uh, since we got this here, oh, you can hear it kind of wants to fire. I think she needs some gas. So, I don't think we need to jump it, which is actually what I was gonna do. But what does need to happen is I need to tighten this down for sure. And maybe I'm gonna check this one just in case. But uh, sounds like maybe fuel. So I think we'll start there. Get some gas for it, fill it up, see what'll happen. So, set you right here real quick, fix that battery get some fuel and then we'll come back when we do some more diagnostic work they seem to have done it we have three people yep three people, three people on guys now we gotta get some gas so i'm gonna set you guys down here and we're gonna look like one of them gas hoarders real quick as i fill up my gas can Go. All done. Now we can head back to the house and give it a shot. Sit there, right there. Oh, it's toasty out here. Now we get to the house as quick as we can so that we don't gotta smell that gas in the car. Let's go. All right, guys, we're back at the house. We got some fuel. We we're gonna fill this old girl up and see what'll happen and the reason we're doing gas i don't know if i mentioned it before but the gas light is on and the gauge reads zero so my assumption is that the fuel is low so let me go ahead set you guys right here and get her filled up maybe oh, oh i don't know if 
I don't know if the stain's gonna like this. There we go. There we go. We good? We good. Alright. You know, I really should have. I really should get a new gas can. And just to be safe, I'm gonna pour a little bit and then I'm gonna check it. So call that good. And I'm I'm checking for leaks. I definitely heard it go down into the tank. Uh, so it, it, it for sure has got to be super low. So I guess let's go ahead and pour some more on in here. Maybe. See how much she'll drink. She thirsty girl. <laughs> Hey, if you're not a thirsty girl, comment down below. Let me know. <laughs> All right, that's that's about a gallon. So now that we've got that all settled, let's uh let's give her a crank. See this old girl fire right up. That'd be that'd be pretty sweet. That'd be pretty exciting, actually because I don't totally remember what the problem was. But I guess when you're me, when you are the Arctic vet, that's what you do, you figure it out. Starting with the key. Here we go. Is this gonna be our first real start? Here's some gas, battery's reading good. Listen for the fuel pump. So essentially, I wish I knew what that meant. I don't know, Dodge guys, do you know what the heck that beep is? Like, Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure. But that's that's really all I can do today though. Give her a quick little try of checking that fuel. And I guess I guess the thing I'm gonna have to do is take off this bed. Because I know the fuel pump was worked on. So I don't really know like what was done to it. Might be able to find out. Other than that, um, man, I don't know. There's there's quite a bit wrong with this truck. But if you were to use it as an old farm truck, it wouldn't matter much. But I gotta take that call. So on that note, smash that thumbs up, drop those comments down below, click that red subscribe button, and ask three of your friends to also subscribe. Have a great day and God bless. Hello?